Hey, what's going on, everybody? How are we doing today? Thank you guys for being here. Um, sorry, I know I'm an hour and 30 minutes late to all of you guys because you guys are all like, oh, shit, man, you started too. I'm trying a little bit pushback time. I want to see if three works better for people to show up and watch the games and enjoy themselves, guys. I'm just testing periods and just ideas. So if you guys are here, thank you for being here. Uh, guys, if you are on Facebook Live and enjoy them. And if you guys are here for Facebook Live, thank you guys for being here. We do appreciate it. I will read your comments, so if you guys decide Facebook Live, and enjoy, I'm just hearing myself talk over and over again. But anyway, guys, so uh, as far as everything goes, I'm reading chat for both, so I will be back and forth, so I will see when people talk to me. So guys, uh, get ready. We are playing some Escape from Tarkov today. Now, if you guys don't know what that is, for a lot of you Call of Duty players, it's basically Call of Duty, the hardest max you can. And instead of dying and respawning or kill ratios, this is more about you scavenging and escaping out alive. That's usually the perk about what this game is. Now, the great thing, though, is that what they didn't say at Gamescom to what a lot of people missed in this part is Escape from Tarkov actually has a very in-depth weapon system, meaning you can mod everything you get that's in this game with something else. So from sights to the grips to everything you put on it, all there. Even goes for your character. So it's very in-depth, and it does have stats, it does have things that work. And I'll show you through some of the builds that we have going on today. So you guys are brand new here, kick back, enjoy yourselves, have a good time. Uh, we're going to get over to it right now, because I, I always forget this. And we're going to go over here, but th there I am. So we're, it's going to look like that the whole time, so sorry, I know it's not the most br best thing that you guys want to see, but it's still good, it's better than what we had before. Like, I, I don't like the box, I think if you guys see me, it's easier. And also, guys, sorry if I'm wearing a, uh, what is it, uh, white beater right now. It is extremely hot in Southern California, and the room that we're in, I'm not going to suffer. So I'm just wearing this. No, I'm not trying to show off these biceps. Who wants these muscles of gamers? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm a fucking cheese ball, no matter what the fuck happens. I'm just, I... I <laughs> Amongst 86 people who just watched that, that was the most ridiculous thing that happened in my life. All right, so we're going to play Escape from Tarkov and get this game launched. So they just came up with the patch. And I'm going to do a scav run because I need some money. Money, money, money. Money. Just going to have that shit happen. And guys, we'll be going to 5 o'clock today, so don't worry about that part of it. All right, so as far as we're at right now, so for all of you guys who have never played Escape from Tarkov, hopefully you guys get this. All right, cool, it's showing up there. Wanted to make sure. All right, so here's the first half for you guys who've never played Escape from Tarkov, and we'll just make it very simple for everyone to understand what this is. Escape from Cart was at Kartoff. <laughs> That's what it is. You know what? Stop. I'm done. I'm done. All right, so from Escape from Tarkov, you get two selections. Now, when you buy the game, the first selection you get is from a PMC, which is basically what I am. You're a private contract military. I decided to go Bear, which is the Russian side. Other people decided to go with USEC, which is the American side. Now, the scav, which people don't understand, is once in this game... So here's the, the idea. You, as a person, get to gear up and load up. So as you can see, this is my character built and loaded up. This is my bear. This is my Russian soldier who will take down the medic. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, so this is my Russian soldier that will work on everything that we have. Now, the scav is separate from your experience as a player. Now, whatever you pick on your PMC, meaning shotguns, uh, SKSs, uh, any crotches, pistols, whatever you decide to use, all the stuff that extensions, backpacks, and everything, they go onto you, and that's cool. You can use that. But here's the problem. If you die, you lose it all. There is no getting it back unless you insure it. But the problem is, eventually, over time, if you're just a bad player and you keep getting insured, you lose all your stuff. Meaning, you have to be successful at your runs at one point in the day. So that means you better find some friends to carry you or other shit. For me, I played it enough, so I should be pretty good for you guys to watch. 
Um, we're gonna start off with the scab. Now, the difference with the scab is, so your PMC levels up. You get different levels, they level up, they become a full character, and there's like a level that you hit. And, uh, you know, the more equipment you collect, the more you can sell, the more money, the better gear, and stuff like that. But, the scavenger is not the same. He is a character that's allotted to you once every hour. This is basically free money, so if you do horribly bad in the game, this guy will at least help maintain where you're at. Now, this game is going to be also an MMO online, meaning it's going to go full-on, blown, like, full RPG style, but there's also the other fact that you can play raids or instances as they go, so that's the part I love about it. So, we're not going to really worry too much. We're going to go over here, and we're going to do a factory run. Hopefully I don't die. This is this is the one I really just fucking hate every time. Whew. Cause there's, I mean, it's limited cheaters, but they, it gets really fucking packed with people. So it's it's scary to me at this point to know, like, you know, am I gonna die? Am I gonna live? Let's see what happens. Look at this, my vape juice is out. Also, I vape, so if you guys watch this, you're gonna be watching the whole thing. Ah, that water is so good. Now, has anybody actually ever played this, or is anybody interested in this? If you guys are interested in this, please let me know. I can direct you and show you some cool stuff for it. Oh, God, here it comes. This is, this is the part I'm going to dread. This is the part I always dread, is like, as a scav, so when you spawn as a scav, you, spend, you spawn in 1 minute, 5 minutes, 45 minutes into the game. Meaning you can run into action, to you can't run into any action. And everything is specific. There's no, like, bullshit. All right, here we go. Whoa. Fucking little dick. Little turd. Yeah, I'm about to get screwed here. Use the bandage. Use the bandage! God damn it. Great. I'm gonna bleed out and lose certain parts of my body. I'm about to die. There's one thing bleeding and I'm about to die from it. So now the one thing I do hate about this game is the fact that like certain scabs are dickheads who are dudes who just turn on you and just shoot you just so they can get loose. Like that. God damn those catters. I fucking hate those catters. Right in the back too. It's good to know I got 5,000 worth of experience from Rum Major. Okay, so now if you guys don't know what catters are, catters are the most ridiculous thing in this game. Because they're just stupid. Like, you can load up and do, sp like, spray runs. Catters are basically for people who want to spray and run for their lives. I hate that so much. Alright, well, we're going to do this again. God damn, I hate that kind of shit. Alright. Alright, so this time I'm not going to go fully loaded up. Uh, this is a bad idea, especially when I'm doing runs like this. So as you guys can see, I have a lot of equipment here. I have backpack, within a backpack, within a backpack, within a backpack, and then I have protective vest, um, and I have my own set right here, which I'm going to just not do that. So I'm going to take my guns and put them back for right now. I'm going to put these over here. Now also you get keys to unlock certain things, which I will do, but today we're going to do a TT run. TT runs are pretty fun to do. I want you guys to enjoy them. Uh, so what I have is an IFAC, and I'm going to put a sprint. A splint in here. Sprint. Sprint. Bringing you the best coverage in the nation. Alright, so here's my TT rounds, just in case somebody decides to get cocky with me. That should handle most of the people in here. I never really have an issue with that much, but... So if you un also, if you unload the ammo, you can see this is your ammo for it, so you put it in. So I carry about, like... Half that. I try to carry half that. 
Screw it. I'll, I'll put it right here so just in case so I don't lose that ammo. Alright, so there we go with that part of it. So we're just going to go straight up just run in the factory to see who we can kill and not die. Because usually we get screwed. Fast Break Jake. I bought the $150 version. It's good, right, Fast Break Jake? Did you get the standard edition? I got the standard and then I upgraded it myself, Fast Break Jake. And also, Fast Break Jake, sorry, I'm checking back and forth between the two, so I'll see your chat. If I don't respond immediately, please don't get discouraged. Same thing goes for myself, the people. Fast Break Jake. And also, uh, Tina, you fat lard, eat the food. <laughs> eat the food, eat the food, man servers. Yeah, Corner and Chicad, the server is just 64 man servers. It's I wish it to go more into it, but we'll see how deep it goes. So hopefully I can keep seeing that live update as it comes along. Okay. Also, guys, if you want to follow us on here, go for it. All right, so we're going to go to the next part. All right, so we're just going to go straight up. Oh, God, I hate this. Really you're going to play with me like that? All right. So we're going to do factory with the TT. Hopefully we don't get shot like we usually do. So now the other part of this is you can insure yourself. So you want to insure. There we go. But proper is also an asshole, so like insuring is ridiculous. So we're going to insure the TT with the therapist because the therapist can do pretty well for herself. And from that, you just kind of got to go for it. And we're just going to ready up. Who do I got in this? Let's see. Who, who's, all, who's all here? Killer Wolf, Sufeta, Jarrett, Cray Master, Analy, Anal Beard? All right. Well, you know, we're just going to say whatever to that idea. Tina, you fat lard, eat the food. Yeah, right. Oh, I'm in a match. Which means it's probably not fresh or it could be fresh. We'll see. Oh, it's fresh. All right. Fucking catters again. Mm. Oh, damn it. And there's the catter again. God damn, I hate those catters. Like, everybody grabs a catter. Mystic G. That's the thing I hate about this game. This this game, the catters are like the most ridiculous fucking thing in this game. It's it's so stupid how they gets played. Well, we're just going back to another character run. So I just what I do is this, and it's because I have pistols to throw away. So I just take pistols and just upload them into there. You know, what? let's just take one of the, the cheesy pistols. We'll go with cheesy either today. Boop, 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 boop. Um, what which one? Is That's this one's right. P ninety threes, yeah. That's P ninety threes. Boop 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 boop. And put those in there. Put it right there. Grab this. Forever, I will hate this fucking game at times with that shit. It just makes me so mad. Ah, those catters. I'll put that right here for right now. All right. Hopefully we don't die on this run over here. That was ridiculous as it went. Uh, Cause they glitched them. Yeah, Kuro Live. That's the one thing I don't like about it is the glitching. I don't know what matches you're getting, but I wish I was getting them. More gear for me. Uh, fast Break Jake, I'm only using the pistol, so going against the catter is a ridiculous part about that. But Fast Break Jake, if you want to join, bro, you're more welcome to. I'm just doing factory runs. It's And I've run into catters every single time, which is really annoying me right at this point. 
It's and I've run into catters every single time, which is really annoying me right now. Alright, so let's do this again. Well yeah, they they glitch them, and that's the thing that annoys the crap out of me is that glitch. And also, I got a uh, fast break, Jake. I got a bigger. Was it? I made it better, or I had a. I had the elf container, but I hit the glitch on that one too, which drove me crazy. And also, I usually stream on my other channel. I'm streaming for my company right now, uh, doing this, and we're just kind of building up the following. So, if you guys enjoy us, guys, thank you so much. Please make sure you follow us our Twitch, guys. We're doing live shows every Tuesday of games that we play, and Fridays, guys. We usually play a lot of other stuff, or we usually do our discussion for Cyber Insider, which you guys should definitely check out. All right, I'm doing the PMC thing. I'm doing the factor runs. Also, fast break, Jake. I do love. Oh, do you want to jump in here, fast break, Jake? Hop on in, bro. Uh, hop into my Discord, and I'll set you up so you can. You can. I always, I always like having a second edition there. So let me give you that, and I'll give you the copy of the password for you to join us. Uh, it's a different Discord. I have a different Discord set up, so. I'll wait till you get in here, buddy. Welcome, fast break, Jake. Do you have a mic? Yes. Okay. First of all, who's your favorite EFT player to watch? Cotton. So, between all of us, I've been talking to that man. So, we'll, we'll be talking later. <laughs> <laughs> no, I know Cotton. Uh, actually, we, we were discussing some stuff today. I So, have you ever heard of Hazed? <clears throat> yeah, Hazed Zero. I'm sub to him. Yeah, he's my, amazing. he's my friend. We usually play together. <laughs> That's what I was going like. Oh, like he probably knows some of the people I know. But yeah, no, Hayes is a homie way before EFT days. Me and him go back. So, like, we both started playing this. I'm like, you're playing this? He's like, yeah, I'm playing this. I'm like, oh, shit, son. So... But yeah, no, I'm, I'm just doing pistol runs at this point where I'm just kind of annoyed by that kind of shit. Where it's like, I know I know what's going on. I just get annoyed by them, like, run, like glitching that fucking pistol every time. You're like, really, dude? You piece of shit? Like, god damn it. But man, we had some good runs last night. That shit was amazing. We found a flyer, picked him out of the sky with an SKS. It was funny to watch him drop. I was like, wait, did we get him? And he's oh, just god, like, yeah. oh yeah. We got he because he stood because he must have been checking something, but he sat there in the midair and I was going like, did is he what is he dead like what's going on with that shit? You know I died twice to somebody that was uh, fly hacking in woods. Yeah, see that's that's kind of shit I. Hate. But yeah, we were we were talking. I was I was <coughs> telling Cotton actually. I said you I go you guys know how you got the cleanup crew. He's like yeah. I go our crew is called the Sloppy Seconds. <laughs> he was like, "Oh dear God!" I was like, <laughs> "That's that's actually not bad." That's pretty funny, right? Come on, like out of everything. Plus, yeah, I, I like that. Plus, we just we I just really started grinding this game, so like I'm learning. I'm still learning on a lot of it. Like it's I can't grind with Haze because like Haze is so good. So like every time we do customs, I can't shoot anybody. I'm like, dude, I need experience. Could you not kill him before I get to the scabs? Yeah, he normally kills everything. Oh, I know. And that's the thing is, like, once you get the map down and you know it, easier. The thing is, like, I'm still trying to learn the map, so it's, like, it's hard for if you're trying to learn the map and the guy's like, oh, I got this. Like, don't walk me through it. I'm not your kid. Like, But no, he's, he's, I love playing with him because it's just, we're, we, we always have fun times. Like, yesterday, like, we shot, we did scab fighting, and we're like, oh, this other scab killed me. This scab killed me. My name is so-and-so. My name's so-and-so, too. It's like, oh, wait, that was me. Oh, we just killed each other. All right, uh, so who are you? Because I'm just going in with a, a Markov. Makarov? Makarov. Uh, I'm loading up. Give me a second. So were you playing this during Alpha Phase? Yeah, I played toward the end of Alpha. Man, I, 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 I bought it praying that they would give me a chance, and then I upgraded it, being like, maybe they'll give me the chance. And then it's just like when Beta finally went, I was like, oh, man. But I'm like, it'll still worth it. Uh, what edition did you get? Because I see that you have the uh, two by two. Okay, so hold on. So I bought the the upgrade from the st standard. So I got the case.
But then I hit the alpha case glitch, which is where some people are duping it. And I didn't know it was a dupe. I just insured my stuff. And then when I insured it, uh, late, and I never left, lost my alpha case, but when I opened up my insurance, for some reason, the alpha, cases, the alpha case was in one of my backpacks. But I, myself, still somehow... Um, was it had so I had my elf case and there was an elf case in the backpack I got back from insurance. So I was just kind of going like, "Well, what the fuck?" Like, I thought this was gonna be insur like I'm like maybe the guy dropped it to be nice because he did something like I don't know. So he sends it like I open it and I try to like replace it or figure out if it's glitch and like nothing happens and I was like, "Okay, well I guess I'll just sell it." And I sold it and then when I go into a raid, my four by four is fucking gone. Oh. Uh, a guy named Sir Borderas that I was playing with earlier had the same issue. He except that happened with his hatchet. Yeah. He was like, "Wait, what's going on with this?" Well, I have two of them. I don't need this one. So he went ahead and sold it, and now he doesn't have a melee weapon. Yeah. See, that's that's the weird part. It was like it glitched out on me, and I'm like, "Why is it? That makes no sense." So I was I was pissed off about that. Like I was like, I really love that case. I was like, "You piece of shit! Damn it!" So, sorry, I was also collecting my stuff. I just realized everything came back from the therapist. That's fun. <laughs> that sounds pretty funny. Um, everything came back from the therapist today. <laughs> right, I'm insured. I'm here. What's your name in here? It's the same as in stream. Oh, got it. Oh, fine. Right, we'll just... Fast. Nope. You're not in factory. No, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm not okay. in yet. All right. Good, 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 good. And I'm planning to upgrade this anyway. That's the other thing, too. Like, I, I like Escape from Tarkov so much. Um, like, you know, I'm not okay. in yet. Because my community has been growing and, like, Hayes hosted me a few times. I'm surprised. We Wait, you were there that night, weren't you? Because that's why your name was familiar. I have no idea. Okay, because he hosts... He normally... He... Go ahead. No, if, if, say what you're going to say. Um, I work from 7 o'clock at night to 7 o'clock in the morning, and since he lives in Hawaii, normally the times that he streams is like the dead hours of my night. So I'm watching him. Gotcha. I'm in lobby now. Um, I'm going to close the door there. <coughs> Got that vape the wrong way. Hi, there you are. One desync sucks. Two out of five people pre was it pre made and was it a map? Only six or seven sucks. It does kind of suck in that, but I also like it because it's not hectic like PUBG. Like, you could be a really phenomenal player, but in PUBG, the second you turn your back on someone, you get shot immediately. You're just like, Ugh. and so like it's 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 really weird to have an esports based around it. Because even that game doesn't stop you. Like, it doesn't really say, like, oh, this guy's incredibly a great player. It just says, like, he's good, but if he, unless he whistles the chicken dinner, it doesn't work. And that's basically what the invitation will turn into. It was a bunch of streamers. The reason why they get chicken dinners is because they just camp most of the time. I'm an aggressive player. I, I'd, I'd rather get in someone's face, like, all right, we have a building. Let's push up. Do we have weapons? Cool. Let's do it. Unless it's like I have to be methodical, then yeah, I'm not going to rush up and just shoot people. By the way, I'm using a cutter. Well, I guess we'll win this match. Well, see you guys. Welcome to the Ketters Nation. <laughs> I just, I don't know. I try to stay away from it because I feel like we re everyone relies on it because it's like a quick, fast, like shot, and it unloads pretty fast and it does the job. But it's just like, I don't know. Well, I'm using them in place of the MP axes right now because I don't have Peacekeeper to four um, or to a level to where I can consistently buy them. Oh, makes sense. Okay. So. Well, we'll clean up and wipe, but we'll try to get out of here before the scavs show up because I was. Those are the just the most annoying things. You know the you know the map callouts, right? To where whenever you where you spawn. I know some, not every single one. I'm still getting like. Okay. I know where forklifts are, where it's in the back, where the ramp comes up from the breach. Uh, I know where breach is. I know zigzag. I know. Okay, so I am. Barrels down the hallway. Okay, you're at barrels. I'm at white light. I'm going to go to the rafters and push player offline. Okay, um, I'm right. Oh, 
God, I don't know what it's called. It's the, it's like where the two doors connect and you... I think I hear somebody moving towards the door. I'm Bory Forklifts now. Or I think it's Forklifts. Flare down. Alright, yeah, I heard that gunfire. Alright, I'm moving towards you. He's, um, he's down at 1986. I heard the shotgun round. That's on bridge side. I'm by zigzag. I'm by zigzag right now, yeah. I'm by the forklifts again. Okay, I see you. Where are you? I'm to your right in the rafters. Oh, I see you. Okay, I'm coming up to you. Making that mad run. Um, uh, actually, first loot that body that's on the backside of 1986. I hear somebody coming right now, though. Got him. Down. Whew. All right, where's 1986? Um, it's right here. Turn around. Oh. Oh, okay. okay. See 1986 on the wall. Oh. And then loot that guy. All right, perfect. Oh, hey. Oh, that's an MP5. Oh. oh. Shit, yeah. Jesus, this dude was loaded right. That was a good run so what far. Fuck my arms up. Oh, he's got a nice IFAC collection going on. Uh, just letting you know, I do have a factory key, so we can get out that way as well. Um, do you have a backpack on you or anything? Uh, he did not have a backpack, unfortunately, but I know the no, other guy did. You. No, I don't. Okay. Uh, come loot the scav, then. Uh, where is this one? The one uh, that's over the edge over there? Is that you yeah. right there? Is that you? Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's you. Okay, get her. Sorry, I got... I, no, there's too many times of when I've had people go like, yeah, that's me, and then it's like I got shot. It's like, oh, oh, no, that was the other guy. I'm sorry. You're like, you asshole. Like, I asked you five times, was that you? Like, Scav down. Another person coming. He's down. Got him? Okay. I gotta grab the backpack off this dude. Sorry, I was searching it real quick. That's okay. Alright, we're cleared. I, it's, it's three down to get it automatic, so hold on real quick. I'm gonna use the... Oh, that's burst still. Shit. Okay, sorry. All right, I think we're good now. All right, um, I'm gonna head to rafters. Yeah, I'm gonna follow you up. I'll just keep your back support on this. Uh, keep an eye on bridge. Yeah. I'm gonna move towards the bridge. Yep, he's there. I'm down. Where is he? Uh, at the entrance. I don't know. I got his friend. Like I got his friend. His friend went down, but I got him. Get All your right. get your bitches. Ah! Fucking God damn it. <laughs> Whew. What did he do? He just shot me in the leg? Wait, this bitch tried to cap me! You dick! Tried to shoot me in the knees, you fucking piece of crap. Okay, that's everybody. That's uh, all players. All right, I'm gonna loot and get the fuck out of here. I'll grab your stuff, or do you want me? To, you got it? You want me to like leave it and toss it somewhere? Or what? Leave it. All right. Unless you want it. I had a scav backpack with an MP3 for with a uh, 133 pack uh, and a cutter. I had three grenades on my body. If you want to search my pockets. No, I'll leave it for you, bro. I, I was like... Well, no, I don't get grenades or medical supplies back. Oh, that's right. So if you want the grenades, take them. All right, where'd you die over? I killed you over here. Yeah, I died uh, on the back side of that tank. All right, so... I'll take this scab backpack. That does give me some stuff to load in.
I always hate this because it's like, please hurry. All right, so your weapons and everything's back over here. So hopefully one of the scabs doesn't see it. They just think that the gunfight occurred between those two guys. And for me to get the fuck out, there is going over the top. Nope, that seems like those scabs just loaded in, which means I better get the fuck out. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, shit! You just shot me. Distracted. God damn, what a fucking bitch. That dude shot me in the right leg. I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> All right, so we got a one level uh, 11. We got a level 30, level 50, one, two USEX. Yeah, there's two USEX that ganged up on you. They were higher level. I don't teach them bitches. Yeah, but I left everything else, your cat and everything, but I just took the scab backpack. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, I was like, I'll take the scab backpack. Alright, MP5. Now time now time to do the most amazing trick ever, kids. Backpack within backpacks. Well, why can I put the backpack within a backpack? Oh, it's because it's its own backpack. I have to put it there. And I have to open this one. I have to put the shotgun somewhere. Why do I have juice? I never take juice for anything. I gotta go organize my shit one of these days. So unorganized. Like, I have random food sitting over here. Some other O flakes. Alright. Got another TT. Grab over some of the tuna. Put it right down over here. All right, and I can have a hard drive, so I'll get rid of that. Bandage is not a big deal. Right, so this is the kind of stuff I'm selling right here. Yeah, I need to get rid of some of this shit. I have too much stuff. Like, I keep thinking the wipe's going to happen, so I'm just like, oh man, this wipe's gonna happen. The wipe isn't gonna happen for another three weeks. Yeah, so that's why I'm just kind of saving up hard drives right now to buy stuff. Alright, what do we got here? Oh, why don't we just put the vest in here? I don't even know why I'm taking my sweet time with that. And apparently whenever the wipe happens, they're supposed to give us the appropriate amount of gear for uh, which version we bought. Oh, very nice. At least I'm happy about that idea. I was like, oh man, what would happen to that? I like the fact you can rotate things and make this, like, like actually be helpful. It, you know, giving I was gonna say like a mini game, a mini game of Tetris. Yeah, basically. Kinda. I'm, I'm okay with the mini game of Tetris. It doesn't make me mad. If your game makes me mad, then you're gonna fucking have a horrible day. All right, I'm gonna load this up on my guy. I have another black rocking shirt, so I'll just take this black with me. Yeah, I'll, I'll ditch the shotgun. I don't really care for it. I mean, I do like shotguns. There's nothing wrong with them, but. I don't think I'm going to be using it. I'm put this cash over here. Gun up. I like how everybody has their own stash in a weird way. Like, they have their own ways set up of, like, their stash and everything. It's, like, a very personal thing, too. Like, everyone's like, oh, I like putting my guns over here. I like putting my guns like this. I'm like, eh. I mean, we all use the same storage. It's just, like, how it's all set up. Like, some people have, like, certain ways of putting their things together. 
we'll bring this down here since that makes more sense. There you go. So we still have a mark off. So I'm gonna I think I'll take this shitty shotgun for this round. Now I'll sell it. What a one three three? Yeah. Um what level do you have proper? Because two of those are two receivers, you can tear them down and then just sell the uh receiver to or trade two of the receivers for a catter. That's, oh, that's right. That's one of the reasons you see so many of them. They're so damn easy to obtain. Well, kinda. Well. Alright, so there we are. Let's probably get that TT out of there, because I don't want to lose a TT to these fools. Alright, there you go. Eh, do I need the body armor? Fuck it. I should use it at one point. Three more brown ammos. More brown ammos. Yeah. yeah. Um, so proper is almost at one million right now. Okay, what's gear at? Because once you get into level two, you have the ability to buy uh Packa. Packa body armor. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm gonna fix gear. So shit. Somebody also wants a cricket. I forget who wants the cricket shit. It's like some stupid. One of them need that's a barter item for somebody. I can't remember who. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to think of right now. I'm like, I can't remember who it was. It's probably going to be um, either a therapist or proper. Probably. I have like two. I have three key keys. Should probably sell them because they just don't really matter. As long as it says key and I have one, that's what I really need in this. Yeah. And I have a bunch of IFACs, so I think I'm just gonna get rid of my my cheeses. <laughs> like I have too many cars and cheeses and then like I have painkillers, but it's like the rest of it's just like I don't need this. Like I have I have four grizzlies. Alright, let's do this part of it. Alright, so we can mod these. Uh, none. Take the handguard off. None. Take the receiver off. None. I don't know what that is. What else can we take out here? Everything is none. And none. So basically we just have a very stripped down gun. Right, that should be enough for proper to really enjoy that. There's that gun turn out, and there's the receiver. So we'll take it to him. I like how it still holds its own place in this. That's kind of interesting. Alright. Open. Open. Oh, no, I don't want to equip it. Open. Alright, I have too much shit in there anyway. Eh, I'll take the tactical rig. It's not a really big deal. Put that PP. And then we'll go back over here. Let's go check and see what everyone else is saying on Facebook Live. Uh, can't play on Steam. Can't, can only buy on website. Yeah. That's what you want to do. How do you play this? Is it on Steam? It's not on Steam, unfortunately. Sorry about that, guys. Yeah. If, I don't, if I don't answer you guys fast enough, you got to go to the Escape from Tarkov website. Uh, and you can actually uh, get it from there. And remember, guys, if you really enjoy it, guys, check it out. It's a really great game. I really, I really suggest it. I really do for you guys. Uh, it's definitely something you want to have people, you know, playing. I love it. It's one of my main games I play. Uh, so, uh, that and I play Daisy. I know that. I think whenever it goes into open beta, or sometime after open beta, they're going to be adding it to Steam. Yeah. All right, so there's that. Now let's go sell these stupid parts and then move on to our next mission. 
Alright, you wanna do another factory run for fun? Yeah, I'm sitting in lobby. Alright. Trading, let me go to proper real quick. Dude, if you break down the shotgun, it's just worth more, it seems like. I mean, is that possible? Um, you may get a little bit more. It depends upon who you sell it to. But. Is oh. that a one? Yeah. You broke down a th uh, one three three. And if you hold on to that receiver, the uh, big red part. Yeah. Um, yeah, if two of those, you can get a ketter. Oh, nice. But it's up to you. I'll save it for the ketter. Hold on. If I can get the ketter with that shit, I'll do that. Proper, is there any other shit I need to sell you? Yeah, take this. Uh, goodbye, Swiss cheese. I don't use you enough. Door keys. Okay, so it's door key, door key, door key. They're all the same thing. So, uh, you, can, you can have this. What else do I not want here? All right, there we go. Deal. Just want to. I just mostly want to clear out my inventory. That's my thing right here. I have enough shotguns, so deal. Oh fuck! I just sold it, and I could have just kept the receiver. What am I doing there, bro? Bro, what are you doing? All right, we're gonna go back. Oh no, you that was a uh, one five three. The only ones that you trade are the uh, one three three system pump actions. Really? Yeah. All right, skier. Oh no, I should have gone to the therapist. That's what I was going to. Skier's more of the accessories. Therapist, buy my food. <laughs> So, who takes the MREs? I forget. Uh, Prepper takes them for something. All right, there we go. He takes MREs and two of something else, I believe. Mm. Oh, there we go. Everything's insured, so it doesn't matter. Insure. Oh shit! Nope. Back up. Back up. Back up. Back up. Oh, you clicked uh, ready one too many times. Yeah, that's the thing about that. I hate that when I'm just like pff, ready up and I'm like, oh fuck, I keep reading. It says leaving the game, so I'm okay. Let me see. Leaving the game. Yeah. Yeah, you should be good. Unless you auto connected to a game, then there might be a problem. Uh... Yep, still full of gear and everything. We're good. All right, factory. Next, next. Next. All right, here I am. All right. Man, chat is not as lively. You guys love watching this game more than talking about it, which I appreciate. You know, I'm, I'm not going to say anything different. I like how a lot of people come in here and they're like, this game's dumb. I can't believe you play this game. I'm like, what's so wrong about this game? This game's awesome. Oh, fresh start. Nice. Yo, you vape. I am GM at Distribution Company. Can I send you over a care package with our products? Uh, Jesse, if you want to, that's fine. I'm at Barrels. Uh, but just contact me later, Jesse, if you want to talk about that kind of stuff. I'm at, uh, God, what is it called? Zigzag. I don't know what zigzag is. Down below. I'm down below where the ramp is. Somebody's coming down right now. I can hear him. You're at red blinking light. I'm dead. How are you dead? 
Yeah, somebody came in through the door and I didn't hear him. Okay. So, you spawned at white light then. Yeah. Oh! Suck it, Ketter bitch! Kneecapped you, hooker! Sorry. I was super excited that I got that from the guy. Oh, fuck! Bad idea, bad idea! Wait, did I get the Ketter? Can I get the Ketter? Get the fucking Ketter and get the fuck out of there! Oh, that bastard! He glitched it! <laughs> fuck you. Oh my god, I got the guy I think who got you. Two, three. Yeah, he was he was just a young hatchling. Guy that got me had a pistol. Fuck, I need somebody who's got some gear, because if I don't, I'm about dead. Six shots. Oh god, oh thank god. I was smart enough. I remembered. Probably up here waiting. He's probably up here waiting. God, God, I hate always just hate that if you like they're waiting for you. There's escape from Tarkov, William. God damn, Ketter got me. Shit. Motherfucker. Every one of them. King K13. I knew he was there. I could hear him moving. I was like, he's there. It was the same dude that killed me. So that was my Ketter. Okay. Well, I got one level one and two level 30s. Two bears, one Usec. Or, oh no. One bear, one Usec, and one Scav. <laughs> I like where that works out. I hate the fact that they're glitching those ketters. That really made me mad. Like, he ran out, tried to ketter me, and I shot him in the legs, and he went down. I was like, yeah, get kneecap, bitch. Like, and then I went to get his ketter, and it was gone. I was like, of course it's gone. His ketter is gone. Damn it. I just want one day for them to forget that they didn't glitch it out, and I can get his ketter from them and be... I want that to be my victory in this game. You know, like, it's it's, it's disturbing that I can't get that guy's Ketter from him. Don't need to hang on. Was it onto them? GM counters for a VSS, I think. AO. Oh, okay. Three more brown ammos, and you can get Silence PP9 Ketter. Uh, 153 trade for M4s. What, $153? Or what are you talking about, 153 Uh, The 153s. The semi-autos. Four of those for a uh, M4. Apparently, you can trade that to Peacekeeper at level three or level four. Nice. All right. All right. Well, ready to do another pistol pistol tier run. <laughs> I'm in my scav run at the immediate moment. 
Uh, I'm done with this, sure. Is it like PUBG? What game is this? Uh, it's called Escape from Tarkov. It's not really like, exactly like Escape from Tarkov, or it's not like PUBG. PUBG is a completely different game's mindset. Like, if you die, you die on that. All right. I tell you guys, moving in, moving in this. All right. Thank you so much. It was fun watching you too. All right. How many hits did I get on that guy? All right. Well, next, I think I think I can actually do my own thing now. I think I can actually do my oh, scab wow. right now. Let me see. Is my scab up? I'm out of it. I died by a lone player that decided to. That's right. Uh, player scav. I'm just gonna put up another pistol because I got a bunch of them right now, and I have TTs that are silenced. Non, I have non-silenced to regular silenced TTs, and I have a PV. Uh, what is it? Is it? Yeah, I think it's. Mark off. Am I correct? Uh, PV silenced pistol growl index was designed for a purpose of arm or was it reconnaissance groups? So I got a silenced uh, PB. Alright, so let's go with... You know, I'll have fun with the silenced PB. I like it. Get the 930, we're good with that. Alright, we'll put that 930 in there. Get those TT rounds, put a 9... There we go. 930 clips. 931 clip. All right, so we're all good on this. Ready to roll? I mean, you're probably more ready than yep. me, but... Let's see, good, good, good. I could have I had another hard drive somewhere around here. That hard drive go? So, there. so what are you saving the hard drives for? Um, I was told you can trade them for another thing. I can't remember what it was. I think it was for a Keter you can actually get it from, from what I have. It's from, it's from someone. I think it's from Peacekeeper, actually. Let me go check it real quick. All right, so I know that you can trade four hard drives for, uh, I think it's either a backpack or a chest rig. One of them takes one, and then the other one takes one's a, one. One's a chest rig. I know that, yeah. So one's a chest rig, but I'm trying to remember. It's someone else who wanted them, and I was like, oh, okay, I'll just store them up and use them. It's like some trade that they have. Nope, that's not it. Here's the silence ketter. I'm back in lobby. Okay. Alright, so we'll go, go get some more and I'll get a ketter on this. Alright. Alright. All right, here. So we'll go. Got, got nothing on me except my fanny pack. So, and hopes we just kill somebody and loot them for their shit.
All right, let's ready up and let's do this. But yeah, man, uh, usually me and Master Ponage play together on our stuff, and then like we'll play with Hayes when he's not playing with cleanup. Yeah, Hayes likes to do solo customs, but something that I've noticed over the past few days is customs has gotten um, exponentially more desync -y. Yeah, it's been really weird. I was been, We were seeing the same thing. We are like, does this seem weird to you? He was like, yeah, it seems super weird. It's like, it doesn't seem right. I'm like, it doesn't. I love that plopping sound. That it's like like that's you loading in. All right, I am. I'm at white light, so I'm heading to the rafters. I'm I'm at 1886. 1986. 1986. All right, so you're red blocking. Generally, what I like to do is, as soon as the game starts, just get to the rafters. It seems like the wise choice, right? Yeah, not a lot of people look up. All right, another player just spawned in. That's you That's on me. the backside yeah, of 1986. Yep, yep. Okay. I hear somebody moving, but I don't see him. I'm watching this side, just to make sure. Player. He's running. He just went back inside, he's a hatchling. Yeah, he's on the other side over there on the left. He's, pro he's only got one way to go. Do you hear him? I heard somebody moving over here. Did you get him? Nope, that's not me firing. Okay. It sounds like someone in the rafters. Which is he just closed the door to the player offline extraction. Oh fuck! Got oh, that's probably a scab. Yeah, it was a scad that just shot me out of nowhere. Is that you? Not below you. Oh, that dude killed himself to running into, uh... Wow, yeah. Hardware. He did, is that you above me? Yeah, that's me above Alright, can you give me overwatch as I loot this dude? Yeah, does a PP. But no ammo. Is that you above me? Yeah, it's me above me. You did, did you just... Oh god, yeah, yeah, it's gun. Please be on fucking single fire. Right, is this you right here? Yeah, it's me down. There's somebody in the uh, hallway. Yeah, I, I, I saw him. I did not. He was in scav. I saw him. He went down the hallway, right? Yeah, he's, he's down in that hallway. I don't know if he's still sitting there. I did hit him a couple times. See if I bait him out that way? Yeah, I think he does. I think he thought... Yeah, I can hear him. He's trying to move over this way. Wait for him. He's dead. Yep, got him. He was trying to loot him. Hold on. Check his friend. Alright, yeah. We're clear on this. I'm gonna take a second. How many players is that? Oh, so here comes somebody. I hear it. Well, 
let's see. There can only be two more players. And that's a scav. Man, die with dignity. Why do you gotta cry like a little baby? Alright, I'm gonna check. Alright, I'm heading back up in the rafters. Alright, hold on. Watch this real quick. Yeah, give me an overwatch on from there. I'm just gonna check this dude one more time. I heard somebody moving, but I wasn't sure. Oh, that's pretty good. I'll take that gun from him. He's got a garage on him. Yeah, those things sell pretty decent. But no other clips. Love it. I think they were new players. Alright, so that should be... Am I... How bad am I hit health-wise? Yeah, I got hit in the chest, but I'm okay. Alright, I'm gonna move. I'm gonna go down this way. I a grenade. Oh, where? Other side of the map. Hello. Where'd that come from? Is that you over there? Is that you who just went around? No, I'm, I'm in the rafters. I'm in the rafters. Unless I say otherwise, I will be in the rafters. There's somebody who went around this corner. He's on the other side over here. Alright, that's you directly below me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But there's somebody around here. Like he had he was a heavy, he had a backpack and something else. Yeah, I hear him moving. I think he's on the other side over here, above the bo boilers. I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna throw a grenade on the back side of the boilers. No, okay, I'm on bridge. I'm uh, down below in the middle of offices. Alright, blast grenade out, and that one should have. I'm up here in the hallway. Is that you? Yeah, okay, that's you. Alright. Yep. Alright. Where was that guy? I don't know. But he's. He looked like he was trying to extract, and I was trying to find him. There he is! There he is! I see him! I see him! Oh, fucking bullshit! He's uh over by the fence where the double meets. Like uh where blue where blue crates are. Yeah, max trash. Yeah, he got me on that one. Got him. Good deal. Oh, uh, this is Escape from Tarkov. PUBG is much better. Uh G Malud, it's very different. Hey, we're sending an email to the email on your Facebook. Just was it responded when you get the chance. Have a good one. I might have a was it I might have this game. Looks fun. Uh when did you send that? Oh well looky there, I have another ketter. I'm extracting. Do we have we have an email on our thing? Do we? I just said it and sent an email. I was like, "What? Got an email? What? So you got yourself Ketter? Somebody didn't glitch it out finally? Yeah, I got. Well, no, I got two Ketters actually because I got an actual Ketter, and then I got two one three threes. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I was gonna like, wait, what? One bear, one scav. Oh, 
Alright, just had to double check some stuff. All right. All right. So, are you? Did you extract? Or are you still in? Oh no, I extracted because yeah. after I killed him, that was uh, kind of like my loot limit there. Yeah. Oh, thank you for the extra ammo, though, dude. <laughs> Much to be obliged, sir. Oh well, at least I made it out with another gratch, so I'm okay. I'm like, oh, I'm not really pissed anymore. I forgot I had a gun in here. I didn't have I had I had nothing to start with, so I can't be mad if I lost something. All right, that is true. I mean, like some people, they're they're so weird about that. They're like, "Oh yeah, man, that sucks." Like I lost all my stuff. Like, and did you really lose anything of like really that much importance? Or like, no, not really. I'm like, so why are you complaining? You know, like it's it's a game. You know, like I like I get it if it's like something stupid. Oi, mate, had some luck today in EFT? Yeah, Yina, I have, I've had some luck in here. How's your games going, brother? Uh, let's see here. Gotta go proper. So now I can buy some other stuff from proper. Uh, what, what can I buy from proper? Because I'm pretty sure, yeah, I can start buying stuff. Oh, this is cheaper. Yeah, cool. AKs are now cheaper to me. Love it. What else we got here? We have a Belmo silencer. What is this? To a 545X39? What is that silence? I'm trying to remember. Is that an SKS? Wait, is it? It's proper? Yeah. And it's sil It's a silencer? It's for the uh, size case. Oh, the PBS4549. Oh, three. yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, that makes sense. It's for the AKs. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wait, that one? Um, that little one? or the, That's a makeshift silencer for the AKUs. Um, it's... Is he at level two? He's at level. Oh, he's at level three. Yeah, no, you should be able to. The uh, cool. yeah, fuck, the thing boring. that you just examined, that is the silencer. Okay, well that's very cool, Yana. Well, the dude, like, it's not like to me. I just enjoy it for what it is. If you don't, if you're like, uh, you know, it's boring. I'm super loaded and stuff. That's fine, dude. But that's why I play the game differently with everybody, and I like the gun interactions. So to be honest, bro, like, I I never find this to be boring. I find this to be quite fun, like. You know, and like, and dude, and this is only the tip of where it goes. Like, stashes, you know, on top of that, we're going to get, uh, what is it, uh, full maps, meaning we can actually create our own teams for scabs. It's just, it's awesome. I'm, I'm excited about this. I want to make, I want to get one of the servers and actually make full out war servers on our, and on my, on my stream, because it's, it's so much easier. Because it, there we go. All right. So, yeah, there were some upgrades to some stuff and things were cheaper. So, that's pretty cool. Thank you, Proper. Appreciate you for being a cheaper hooker. Uh, how much are the ketters to me? What do I have to trade for a ketter? Oh. Oh, it's I need four scav vests. What? That is not worth a silence ketter. Forget that idea. Two scav backpacks, two scav vests, or four scav vests, and seven brown? Yeah, that's a little ridiculous for him. That's when you never see a silent ketter. Ever. Proper, you're you're an asshole. I know the comment was that's coming, but for now I am at the same point where I were was I were in alpha. When you get your traders on max, your rubles ready, you can buy everything. That's very true. It's very true. But I just I like it where it's at, man. Like I I like I I'm going back up the grinding ladder and relearning the game. So I get it. Like your vest, the scav BP, I can buy those for less than 4k rubles. I'm glad you can, man. I can't right now. <laughs> Uh, if you if you want to one up me, you can just keep going for it, man. I, I don't know what to tell you at that point. Uh, let's see here. Skier, I gotta start figuring shit out for him. He, he takes shotguns, huh? All right. All right. Uh, so what I was getting? Ammo. That's what I was going for. I was gotta buy ammo from proper. Proper. Uh, let's see. Bullets. 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 Nine nineteens. Where was those bullets for nine nineteens? Come on. I know you're here. 725. 919, bro. Oh, uh, it's probably gonna be a skier if I have to get anything or fence. Fence is probably gonna have that shit. Really? He has none? Fence usually has some stupid random shit around here. It's hit and miss with him. I would have figured he would have had that bullet. Oh, here we go. Yeah, he has. He has him. 
I mean, I keep playing it, but I play it for the PvP now, not for the loading or farming. Oh, no, I love the PvP. I like it all. Like, I find it to be, that's the exciting part for me right now. I will buy 60 of this. Because you are so cheap. There we go. Plus, I'm not even getting anything from my stash yet, to be honest. I'm in lobby for whenever you're ready. Alright. Let me get this clip in here. What was the clip? Just 9 by 19 clip, so. Proper has those, I know that for sure. And to be honest, bro, I've been just getting mostly kills with just, like, pistols. I mean, I don't think... Oh, the MP5. That's what I was... Oh, I, but wait, we escaped the MP5. I'm pretty stoked, right? Yeah, there it is. Yay, I had the yeah, MP5. You did. I was like, okay, cool. I was like, I totally forgot that I had the MP5. I'm like, oh, man, that fucking dick. And I was like, I thought he shot. I was like, oh, that was around after with the Ketter dude. That pissed me off. Ketter guy is just so annoying at times. You're just like, dude, really? But I get it. I get oh, it. I'm not, not going to lie. Ketters can be an absolute pain in the ass. Oh, yeah, with some oh. of the players? Because, well, because, like... I like I like it when you change it up and you challenge yourself. I don't like it when you just rely on the same gun that everybody else is relying. It's just like, eh, that means you're not really trying to be skilled at this. You're just gonna keep doing the same shit. I use him as a placeholder for the immediate moment because I got a guy that I watch named Coach, uh, and he mainly plays with nothing but the American weapons. Um, he's been playing since. A long time uh, he's the one that got me into the game mm. and what do you call it um he uses mainly mp5s and mpx's for uh for factory mm. Oh, those are those are the wrong bullets. I'm all trying to drop the bullets, and they're like, "Get in there, you stupid bullets!" I'm like, "Oh, wrong bullets." All right, there we go. And we'll put one IFAC in here. Cause we'll put the the lower IFAC in here. Oh, there we go. There's a the lower one. And so sprint IFAC bandages. We're good. All right. PMC factory next. Uh, real quick, and like make sure that people are talking on the Facebook. Uh, Kogan Hooli, this game is like I said, it's Escape from Tarkov, bro. All right, and then we're gonna go to Insure All. We're good. Oh, it's already insured. Is it insured? I think it's insured. Yeah. All right, there we go. Let's ready this motherfucker up. And if my English is a bit off, that's because I'm from Europe trying my best to write shit. You can understand. Dude, Yana, it's all right. I don't, I'll, I'll read it, man. I ain't going to judge you. Be like, you fucking Europeans can't write worse shit. Like, that's, that's, that's it. Oh, fuck. I'm in the game. Wait, are we in the game? Uh, we're matching. I aborted. Abort? Abort? I for, I for a minute there, I thought well, I, I went too fast. No, no. I mean, like, we're in a, in a group. Is everything all right? Yeah, I, I just aborted because I, I panicked for a minute because I thought I, I went too fast without you and I thought I hit okay and I was like, wait. No. All right, I'm back in the lobby again. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, you're back. Oh, you're. I backed this. I went, we went backwards. I just, I was just because I was worried for a minute that there was going to be an issue. So I was like, wait, back up, back up. I, just, I sent you the invite right now. Hold on. Apparently, whenever you aborted, it kicked me out as well. Okay, there we go. Oh, nice. I got my helmet back. I'm in. You can start it. Okay. Redo this. I hope I get something back from those woods runs. I was. What I went into both of those games. Uh, Packers, uh, fully geared. 
head to toe and died within the first five minutes due to a flying player. So basically this shat all over you in the game. Yeah. That sounds delightful. It seems like the only thing that I can run right, right now without having to worry about anything is a uh, factory. And the only thing you got to worry about is kitter glitchers and pistol glitchers. But I guess I'd take that over, you know, spawning in and getting shot in the head. Yeah. All right. We are 20 seconds late. I'm at red light or blinking, red blinking light. Where are you? I am at... Fuck, I just heard, um, where I started, uh, 1986. When you say 1986, what do you mean by it? Right. 1886, oh. whatever. Oh, you're player offline. That's you, it was running just a minute ago, right? Yeah. Okay. Is that you down at that? That's not me, I'm actually not the one shooting. Okay. Uh, well, we'll see what happens with that. Somebody just threw a grenade, and I don't know why. That was me. He's dead. You got him? Alright. Yeah. Let me go check him real quick. Because I heard him, but I wasn't sure where he was at. Where was he at? He's at a uh, player offline. Really? Do you know where that's at? Uh, it's across over here, right? Where I'm running? Yep. No, 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 no. You're going to barrels. Turn around. Oh, is that you? Sorry. Oh, God. I just I, sh yes, I shot you once. Me. I shot you. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. Fractured my arm. Sorry, sorry. If it makes you feel better, I just got trigger happy? No, I have a friend that he's still working on it, but he used to be terrible at it. Right, I'm Maybe, gonna uh, load into a match. You'd be like, I'm here, and then you'd be like, oh, oh god, I didn't know that was you. It's just like I just told you that it was right there. Hey, do you want to go across this way? Give me cover, and I'll just push into there. Uh, I'm in the rafters. I know, but you have Overwatch over me, and that's why I'm moving this way. You can see things yeah. as I move. Move up to the uh, stage. This is the stage right here. Yeah, you're on stage. All right, I'm on stage. All right, come on in. Head to third floor. I'm on the third floor right now. All right. Are you fucking kidding me? Professor Plum. Does it have a Because it should I have. I didn't get him, but he ran for it. I really wish they fixed the RGDs. Um, if you hit the tilde key, uh, if you see a string of pull object destroyed, that means that he extracted. No, I hear him. He's up here. Yeah, he's over here trying to figure everything out. It seems like he's just camping it like everyone else. There's still one grenade on my body. I'm just trying to protect your body from anybody who tries to come up here. Just go to my body, grab the grenade, and then uh, if he's still in the stairwell, then just toss it down. Fucking find the grenade. Come on. Where is it? Is it in your backpack? Pocket. It was pocket. In Always in the pocket. Alright, I got it. Which was he trying to break open?
It's probably downstairs trying to look for me. Because I heard him open the door. Yeah, he's down there. Yeah, somebody destroyed. They pulled everything out. Yeah, he extracted. So he must have been the close to last player, right? I honestly don't know because we got into that game late. However, I'd loot that scav and then probably jet out of there. That's what I'm doing. Got him, dropped him. He was trying to loot you. Nice. That's why daddy brings an IFAC. Probably about time. If you hit O on the keyboard, it'll show you the in game time or how many uh, minutes is still left in that rate. Alright, it's time to get out of here. Scabs are starting to appear and I don't like it. Oh fuck! Shit! No! No! Don't get me killed! Fucking scabby pieces of crap! God damn it, they keep hitting me in the chest. I did have body armor on. Yeah, I'm not going to steal your body armor, though. Nah, I always buy more. Shit, there's another scav. I'm not gonna say to wait. Show your fucking pretty face. Woo! That was a good run. That one came. There was somebody that came in distraction with you. No, I thought he was. It sounded like it oh. was. Ah, uh, but it was all. It was all a bunch of level fours. I got four level four kills. I killed three scavs, one bear. Yeah, so they were players. <laughs> Four players. They're like, ooh, we're gonna scavenge his stuff. Like, no, you're not. <laughs> that sucks for those guys. That was a good run. I got one more in here. Is your scav up or is it not up? No, no, my scav's got half an hour.
just realizing how much gear I lost today. And it sucks. So we'll take this. All right. Uh, all right. So let's see. Escape from Tarkov. We got one more round. This goes. I started late. Uh, should probably unload my character before I go charging anything. All right, do you want to do some kind of other run? Say again. What would you like to do run-wise? Uh, what you mean, like what map or? Yeah, yeah. What do you have to do? Because I, I can do any. Generally, I just stick to factory right now, unless okay. it's a time whenever there's not a lot of people on, then I'll go into customs or something of that nature because of how bad customs is with desync right now. Yeah, it's been so horrible. Like, we were playing yesterday, and, like, we were just seeing it. We're like, why is everyone lagging so bad? I'm like, I don't know. I go, but there's some bad lag going on in this game. Like, it's just, it's horrible. I mean, there were situations whenever I was playing yesterday. Um... I wouldn't extract for like two or three minutes. Yeah. Alright. Well, at least now I can get myself a Keter if I really want to. I don't care this scab shit with me. And I got you. Yeah, just if you, if you use a Keter, um, bring at least two to three stacks of ammo with you. Yeah. I figured because it Because it eats through it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> With what you're firing? I'm all like, yeah, that probably does eat through a lot of it. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I'm pretty much good to go. Alright, so, I'm gonna go shotgun this round. Make myself more applicable in the sense. Alright, I'm using MPX. Silence MPX. All right. And I'm in lobby. All right, cool. Just, I have to also make sure I read chat so people don't go like, wait, why aren't you reading chat? I'm like, I'm trying to read everyone, calm down. Alright, there we go. Alright guys, we got one last round of this and then we're gonna call it a day. Cause I also have to take care of other business that's going on tomorrow. Right, insure all, thank you. Alright, I'm ready to go. I like how one of the scabs shot at me and then he got stuck on barrel and as I ran past him, I'm like, wait, that's the same fucking dude. <laughs> Alright, I'm in. Alright. Here we go.
1986 or 1886? I'm saying it wrong. It's 1986. 1986. Okay, so 1986 to me is where those those lockers were and everything, and like crates on top of that floor. Yeah, yeah, that that is 1986. But whenever you fall in and you say you're at 1986, I don't know exactly what you mean by that because there's two spawns that are right next to it player offline and red blinking and both of which can get there pretty quick okay so player offline is where i usually start where that guy was all right and i am again at player offline i'm at red blinking or not red blinking uh white light i'm heading up the top i'm at 1986 on 1986 right now that's me. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I am so sorry, bro. I just saw somebody running. I didn't hear you call it out. My bad. My bad. Are you okay? I'm good. You hit the body armor. Thank God. All right, somebody just spawned in. Yeah, I just heard him. Got him. Whoa. Did you get him, or was that you? Um, somebody is lighting my ass up. I can hear him, but I can't find him. Oh, oh. Drop some fool. All right, drop the scab. I'm doing everything I can to keep myself. I'm dead. Dude, I don't know where I was getting hit from. Oh, don't tell me it's a flying in there. Are you up there? Where are you at right now? I'm dead. Um, I got killed by Meepins. No, I, I don't think that he was flying in the air. I think that he was in the rafter on the other side of the map. Fucking yeah, and he lit me up. He had a cat or two. That's the one thing I hate about getting killed by the Ketter is the ever rounding sound of da -da 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 -da. His name's Meepins. Yeah, that's the same dude that got me. Yeah, I got one level. Do you know where he was? Yeah, he was up in the rafters. He was going for your body, and I saw him. I'm like, do you know where you're at? And then he just appeared on your body. I was like, fuck! And I just, like, moved out of the way. I think there was some desync involved in that one. Yeah, I should have waited, because I knew he was going to try to come loot your body. It's like the first thing everybody does is like, let me go loot that body. It's like, mmm. You want to do one more run? I don't know what I don't... What? What I don't get is that there was somebody that spawned in at barrels. Yeah. And I put three quarters of that magazine in on him. Said only five times, so I didn't get that kill. And then that other dude lit my ass up. That is weird. I'm not going to lie to you. So I think that there's some desync that was playing in that one. No, I can't get my first cutter. Bastard. Well. And I'm going to put myself on a grotch because it's insured. I'm just going to go light some people up. Wait, did I ever pull, pull those clips out? Please tell me I took the clips out. <sighs> Duncan. <laughs> so I still had the clips on me when I last loaded out because I keep forgetting they're so small and I need to check all my pockets. This is what my mom tells me. Always check your pockets. All right. Well, oh no, there it is. I got it. Never mind. I'm good. Woo! Thought I fucked myself in that moment. All right. Unload. Oh, there we go. All right, I'm ready to go. I'm buying ammo right quick. All right, guys, this will be the last game for the day, and thank you for everyone being here for Escape for Tarkov. I do appreciate it. I'm going to check real quick the comments. Sorry if I didn't see everyone's comments. All right, guys, this will be the last game for the day, and thank you. So let's hear, hey, guys, what up, Matthew Sullivan? How's it going, man? Nate Barlick. What's the TDLR of this game? Uh, so Nate Barlick, it is very different, but it's definitely fun. If you love hardcore first-person shooters about survival, that's what Escape from Tarkov is. If you're not really into it, it's totally fine. Everyone's got their, you know, t like taste and what they want. This just requires more skill, so you're not just running around randomly shooting people and like blowing through your weapons. 
You know, I know, I know it, PUBG is more of a boiled down kind of version of games. But I like it. It's not a bad game. Don't get me wrong. All right. Let me know when you're in. Okay. How'd your nap go? Brilliant. <laughs> I could hear it. I think, I think, I, yeah, and I think Janet was outside too. I, I think she's, I think you guys passed out. It's like, thanks guys. Appreciate all that extra energy after the gym as I was on one stream. <laughs> like, radical, let, let's see, I like reading these names. These names are entered. Douche Waffle. That guy Goldie. Mr. Kindy G. Abrams. Abraham. There's a dude named Cheese Farts. Nice. Killer Sheep. Honky Kong. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Raise those people. Show me your papers. Wow. Top Potato. The troll guy. <laughs> Bamboozle. Jesus. Tablespoon. Radical Removal. Chaotic One. Ghost Rider. I feel like I know that guy. Mad Hate. Tenate Rita. Smooth Operator. Pretty good. Modders. Kess. Yeah. Wait, are you in here or where are you at? Nope. I uh, was about to head in. Then I realized I didn't have any body armor on. Alright, I'm in. Alright. I just love his name, Douche Waffle. <laughs> <laughs> like, I mean, I've heard of a blue waffle, but a douche waffle, that's a new one. I'm in group. Alright, let's do this. Let's go light some fools up. I know what's going to happen as I say, let's go light some fools up, and then I get lit up out of nowhere. No, I just don't know what's going on with today, because it's been terrible. The game's weird like that. You go through cycles where you do good, and then you do a lot of bad. Right now, I'm in one of those down cycles. See, I've been doing pretty good for everything. Like, I... like. I'm, my kill ratio has been good for Factory, and it's fun. And I like it because it's it's given me the chance to be like, dude coming from the left, dude coming from the right. And I can hear him, and that's the great thing. I That's why I love my Astros. Uh, but I can hear him and everything, but it's this is like still kind of difficult where you're like, oh, what is this? Yeah, it can be. Tailored house. The flavors on this are not that great. And I like it. It's like a, it's called strawberry crunch for what I'm having. It's basically like, oh, here we go. Loading in. Look, and I'm on, I'm basically spawning it offline. I'm at forklift. I'm at 1986. Is that you running up there? Yeah, that's somebody in the rafters. Oh, that wasn't me. I'm all the way on the other side of the map. I'm coming over to your side. On my left of 1986, is this you coming up? Please tell me this is you coming up. No, I'm, uh... I'm coming up to 1986. If you see somebody else, hit him.
There's a dude up here on rafters. Alright, I'm on rafters at 1986. Where are you? I'm right here. I'm like, right under here of 1986 against this wall. Right here, you see me? Oh, okay. Alright. Okay, okay, so there's a dude straight in front of you. He ran across over there, so be careful. There's a dude on the rafters. On the other side of the map? Yeah, he bolted after I started shooting at him. Whoa. I'm moving up, pushing towards blue crates. Player down. I'm by blue crates over here on the rafters. Can you give me visuals or anything above me that I should be aware of? Uh, no, nothing that I can see at the immediate moment. All right, where are you? I can't see. I don't. I'm throwing a grenade towards uh. Dear me. Trash cans. Yeah, that's me. I was no. trash cans. So oh. I'm over by trash are you cans. Alive? Yeah, I'm alive. I'm fine. Okay. Sorry, I. This is trash cans. I thought you were still in 1986. Yeah, I call them dumpsters. Okay, dumpsters. I call them blue crates. Okay, it's the dumpsters. All right. Uh, I'm going to go on to this other side of the room. There looks like there's a lot of guys dropped here and some players. Yeah, there was a dude that was, uh, I dropped him. He's back behind, he's underneath me right now, underneath the bridge. Uh, somebody just Whoa. screamed at me. Dropping down. Somebody just called at me. I'm on floor level. Ow. Dropped him. Okay. Where are you? I'm in a cargo container at the immediate moment. I'm coming out. I'm underneath bridge. Underneath bridge. Oh. Yeah, the the big thing up there. It's called bridge. Okay, I just took this dude down, but I don't know if there's somebody else. I need to overwatch while I go overdo it. Is that you? Tell me that's yeah, you. That's me. Okay, God. That's me. It's me. I don't know if it was you or not. That's why I had to be careful, bro. It's like, is that you? All right, so we've killed one, two players. Oh, that's where that dude died at. Alright, so we know that there's three players dead. One of them's right here. This is, I can guarantee you this is glitched. Yep, he pistol glitched at 84 round drum mag. So we caught him by surprise and he pistol glitched as usual. Yeah. Got it. hit. This is you picking up on, okay, that's you. On stop, yeah. stop, stop, don't move, Just, don't move. Okay. I thought I heard something, that's why I was double checking. Checking this dude right now. And the search is actually for the tactical rig is going AWOL, so I can't see what he what he has on his tactical rig. Also I just checked scabs now because they there's I guess the chance of what I hear that, that you can find the keys now. Um and only on the uh, if you're looking for factory key, it's only going to be on the, what's it called, uh, scav backpack ones. Okay, so that's the rarity of this one. Yeah. Alright, um, player scav is going to be able to spawn in in just a little bit. Alright, you want to go check upstairs, see if we can eliminate some people or get out of here? Oh, what? wait, what did this uh, guy have? Hmm. It looks like a giant sized dildo. I don't know what it's. Oh! Oh! That I actually need. I hear running. Yeah, I hear it too. Where are you at? I'm on third floor. Alright, I'm gonna come join you on third floor because I do not want to stay down here. I'm going up on stage. Oh! Hi. Did you get him? I have no idea, but that was a grenade. Oh, that, that's a fully geared player, by the way. He's got a helmet and everything. Where is he at? Um, he was on third floor. Is he? Ah, oh, fuck! I don't know if he is now. Oh, uh, no, I just got shot by him, so that was a good one. I'm getting to extract fuck this shit. 
If he's fully loaded and I got a pistol, that's not going to spell well for me. Did you, did you get him? Not yet. Okay. He got me. See if I, I knew. I don't know how many times I hit that guy. Of course, it only says that I landed five hits. I can't. I don't know where you're at, so I can't shoot at him. No, don't worry about it. You just get the hell out of there. Like that dude had a tricep, pack up. Helmet, everything. I see him. He's extracting. Yeah, he just went to extract. Yeah, because he found another geared player in the game. So he's getting like a little schoolgirl. Damn it, he got me. He was sitting there waiting. He was spawn camping. Or he was like fucking exits camping. Fucking yeah. bitch. MGTK. Yeah, he got me. He got me. It's all it's all unfair. It's tactics. I do the same. I can't I can't I can't go like, oh no, you're a dick. Alright, guys, so that will be the end of this stream. I do appreciate everybody for being here. Guys, uh, we will be here on Friday. Guys, check it out for Cyber Insider. We're going to be discussing more about games and the world that goes around it. It's an open topic discussion, so you guys can always join in and pitch in your two cents so you guys feel like you're heard because, I mean, we do hear you. I don't want to say you feel like you're heard, but yeah, you know. So, guys, thank you, everyone, for being here. We do appreciate it. Guys, you've been nothing but great. Uh, guys, remember, if you really like everything, please make, please make sure you like, share, and comment. Uh, fast break, please do add me. Uh do you have my Do you have my other channel or no? I have no idea what your other channel is. Oh, I will put it up. So for you guys who want to keep watching me, or you guys enjoy it, you guys check it out. Handswatch.tv, Pwnedcast. That is me. So you guys can watch my channel if you guys want to watch more Escape from Tarkov or any survival horror games, or if you guys like stuff like that, check it out. And there we go. Same here. Twitch.tv slash Pwnedcast. There we go. Should be right there for you guys. Remember, no, and you can't make it. I will, however, forgive you for this Funko pop-ups behind you. What? Oh, those Funko pop-ups? I didn't know. And thank you for that host again, Unknown King. I do appreciate it. Isn't this the Cyber Guild building? This is a lie. This is a lie. It's not a lie. Shut up. Anyway, guys, thank you for everyone being here. I do appreciate it. Uh, you can still stick around fast break. Uh, I just got to make sure I turn this off. And, guys, as usual, if you guys like everything, please make sure you like, share, comment, let other people know you're here. And, guys, as usual, as we always say... Thanks for stopping by. Have a good one, guys. Man, this is just not my luck tonight. Don't talk. <laughs>